guys in my kitchen you know making a little bit of dinner and so i wanted to just show you a really quick meal that i love to do and i use this either as a side dish or i use it as the base of a bowl so i add vegetables and i add different sauces but this one is just really simple my four-year-old likes it my two-year-old likes it my husband likes it it's a family win so i wanted to share it with you because it's also really healing and anti-inflammatory it's a feel-good food for me so try it out for you and see if it's a feel-good food for you so the first thing that i did and i'm using a big pot because i make a lot and I also can't find my smaller pot. So this is sprouted quinoa. I use the sprouted because it makes it really easy to digest. So I'm just gonna plop it in here um, with the water. So if I just quickly add some spices. Now, I'm almost out of curry powder, but that's one of my favorite things. A tablespoon. Um, and then I add some turmeric in, and I would say another good tablespoon or two and then I add cumin um, and then you know you can really add any other spices you like a little bit of black pepper actually enhances turmeric okay so my other secret ingredient great for digestion great for minerals is kombu seaweed now does this sound delicious no it just looks like this and I just add in just, I haven't done anything to this yet. Just add in the kombu seaweed and then I just cook according to the directions. Now, before you eat it, you're gonna wanna take the kombu out. Kombu is also really good if you make broths, you know, to bump up the nutrient density. Also spices, and we'll talk about spices more as we go, but spices are your super, super powerhouse in terms of adding nutrient benefits to your food. So, I hope you enjoy.